don't believe you're a worthy woman? If your self-talk stinks, you probably don't feel worthy. Here's a very fast, neat, complete, and discreet primer that'll turn that self-talk trend around. Hi, I'm Stacey Storino from Woman 101. Do you feel worthy? Do you speak to yourself with kindness, with love and respect? No? Didn't think so. You're very likely your own worst critic, which means you don't feel worthy as a human being, and you'll likely tell yourself that six ways from Sunday all day long. Ugh. Start turning that bad habit around in three steps. One, step one, decide you've had it with filling your own skull with poison. Being your own biggest hater is exhausting. Really and seriously, make a commitment to having more compassion for yourself. No one can do this for you. Get serious about speaking nicely to yourself. Make a point out of finding ways to prove that you're worthy instead of beating up on yourself again. Move on and lighten up on yourself. Step two. Recognize that you're one of us. We're all in this together. We all make mistakes. We all don't get things right the first time. We're all imperfect in the race to try to be perfect when all we really should do is try to be whole. There's a difference. Just stop criticizing yourself all the time. After all, we don't live on in heaven or nirvana. We live on planet Earth. Nothing and no one is supposed to be perfect here. If perfection were the gold standard for being worthy, none of us would ever be worthy. That can't be right. Resolve going forward to be the best that you can be. That's all you're capable of anyway. Focus on your why or your reason for living and use smart goals to take you there. That's where you should focus your energy, not into beating yourself up worse than any bully could ever do to you. Step three, pivot away from the negative to the positive to acknowledge yourself and your circumstances in the best light. No one is telling you to be delusional and ignore the negativity of life, but make the decision to move out of the darkness of your most recent epic fail and walk into the light of the lesson you've learned. In that case, tell yourself that you're a worthy human being who is learning lessons, making distinctions and growing, and that you're doing the best that you can with what you've got to work with. As time goes on and you become more experienced at life, you'll learn more, succeed more, and hopefully convince yourself along the way that you're more worthy than ever before. But you're worthy now, though. Don't miss that point. Value yourself first and foremost. Others will either get with the program or hit the cutting room floor. Speak to yourself with sweetness instead of filling your cranium with strychnine. Now, I'd really love to know if you found any of this advice helpful. So go ahead and comment down below. Smash that like button. Share this video. Subscribe to this channel for more free life coaching. We're coming out with cool new videos that'll change the way you live your life. You're a chick with a heart of gold. It's Woman 101's mission to help keep that heart happy, healthy, smart, and strong. Woman 101, be wise with your heart.